Dear business owner, you have been the soul of our city longer than any chronological scroll could accurately tally. Acting as a guide to entertainment, adventure, learning, and wonder, you are both hands with all five fingers, pointing us towards refuge as we navigate the wilderness of an urban jungle. The richness of our collective sector breathes life into the streets, spilling across parkways, lanes, roads, and avenues like a heart that has abandoned the comfort of its sleeve to be with the people. You make this pocket of Turtle Island a city to build our dreams in. And depending on where your feet stand and upon what your eyes glance, you might catch a glimpse of a rainbow of storefronts, plazas and markets, a garden of community members that resemble the gatherings in our own families, with the only difference being that sacrifice and failure become a part of the painstaking process of planting hope where grief once grew. Your window pane beams with pride as you welcome the rays of a new day and familiar faces inside. Your presence turns boring into luxurious, anonymity into a society on the brink of crafting a unique cultural identity. Your resilience transforms the cynic mind that believes that we must leave the city to succeed, and your will to thrive is rivaled by your charitable smile. You know chaos, loss, loneliness, and corrosion. The feeling of witnessing the end of an era is far too common of an experience, but you also know that flowers can still bloom in a dying bouquet. So you raise your weary bodies out of your bed every day with the hopes that someone, somewhere, will sample your offerings and their patronage will suit their senses. Your business owner, you were made for piloting turbulent storms. When you feel like screaming into the void where no one can hear you because the phrase, I need you, teases the mirror that you stare into before your morning commute, I want you to know that the feeling is mutual. We need you. For the act of receiving is only useful when the act of giving is present at the table. So no matter if you reside close to Hintonburg, Strandherd, or Tangen, in the Glebe, South Keys, or Orleans, or anywhere between the West and the East, we will not let a pandemic change our course, for this chapter is not about survival, it's about revival. You're a business owner. We see you. Thank you. You've given us so much to be grateful for. Together, we will weather the storm. When you have poured of your cup to the point where your efforts appear minuscule, and the energy you use to stay afloat is washed away in the race to rest ashore, I know that what you have in store is so much more.